or anything. Hello and welcome to the next episode of Banner Saga with me, Windslayer. I think we're ready to start the battle. Maybe do this. Hope that these guys are able to hold their own. It's not going to be an easy fight and we're not going to push our luck because we got some injuries we got to rest off after this. See one, two, three big dudes. Let's see. Yeah, okay, good. The desktop audio is coming through. It was just super quiet in the in that menu. Cool. I'd turn it down a little bit so you can actually hear me with this going on. Yeah, that seems like a good volume for it. Alright, so we got a big hitter here, another big hitter there. Some little ones along the side. Hakon's gonna have to run in and, and hit one or two of these in the face. I feel like we should try and go after these ones since they're up north, kinda isolated. Why did I bring somebody with four health? Mogur should have been here, not this guy. That was a terrible choice. Alright, we're gonna try and, and bring them to this corner and um, hope that that works out in the end. Ready, I think, right? He's at the end of the rotation here. I'll block him with this guy. be able to hit that as well. Aye, aye, aye. Kind of wish I placed him there so he could have smashed this one off to the side now. It's like a little person there, frozen. <laughs> that's, not, that's not very nice. Look at this. So much detail. Yeah, I might not win this fight. This guy's gonna move forward. Gonna hit my guy. Probably do two damage. Because I didn't give him a way to get away from this. Well, I could run to this corner. Yes, let's run to the corner. Let's just use three willpower like that. Just like that. Oh, and wonderful. He can't get an attack in now either. What am I doing here? outnumbered, which I'm not a fan of. Rally our friend.
just support him by parking Bercy next to um, Gris. turn there, see how we fare. Alright, either hit this one or this one. Or hit this one. Just kill him. Just outright now kill him. Yes. One less one to deal with. He might just have his attack, which would be really, really annoying. guy here and we're actually going to rally two more points onto him ouch does he have a tempest he does so clockwise means this way guy there to kind of make them think about coming over here. Ouch. Yeah, that was a pretty big hit. Not very nice, dude. Take him here, I think. I'd love to use that battering ram in combination with a Luden. Just have him just kick people around. This guy has 11. Probably should tr try and do some damage to him since I have the ability to just kind of throw willpower on people. Good, 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 good. That's what I wanted to see there. Clockwise means go this way, right? Yes. Hey, and he actually hit the guy behind him, too. Ouchie. Did a point of armor damage there, too. Just good to see. Hack 
back on. How are you going to do this? Get in here and start doing some damage to this guy right here. Right there looks nice. So this guy's going next, and I can attack him. So he's got 11. He can do 2 damage to you. So can that guy. attack. It's probably best to retreat him and then use his um, his armor break on this guy maybe. Hakon can do 8. No. Use armor break on this guy I think. 8 damage do one point of damage to him. Alright, go do one point of damage to him then. Ooh, I can do a lot more than that. Alright, put some hurt on this guy. Clockwise means go for that target. It's the guy behind him too, sweet. Oh, he's going in to bring another dude into uh, this match. So I can do 8 against 8. Eleven against that. It won't be enough. We're gonna need both of the guys in here to reduce this guy to nothing. Do some armor breaking here. This guy does good armor break. Whoops. Not what I wanted to see there. Pushed him out for a range of being able to take this dude out. That's like give him two. And then I need three to kill because it needs 12 damage and he does 11. That actually worked out a lot better than I think he thought it would. Than what he was planning to do, rather. Let's impale him. You're a jerk. Ouch. You can do a little bit of damage to old Bercy, it looks like. Kill this big one right here. That's what he can do. Sure, kill him. Ouch. Strip armor off of that guy. Just 
see, I only get one armor strip, so... I think what I'm gonna have to do is move to here. And give him a point to rally on Luden. Cause he doesn't have any right now. Come on, Luden, you gotta impale some dudes. It's your destiny. Bursi here has got another round of Tempest he can do. Clockwise means start on this one so it goes that way. Good job, Bursi. Doing your job. So they just brought another guy in from here. Eleven attack. So Thirteen can kill this guy. Can't kill that guy. down there and break some armor. See that or just focus on this guy a little bit. that willpower later. 13. Some armor damage, I don't like that. This guy's going next, followed by this big guy, and that one. So he's he's after Ludin. get the attacks that go through people because I'm not seeing it for everyone. Alright, Faust, even though you got like no attack and useful here. What does this thing do? Does it do anything? It just taunts them? Okay. Let's do some armor breaking then. Leave him alone! So an eight. Almost able to kill that dude. Yeah. My 
I can't kick him back now, because... Of the setup of units. It's troubling. But I can hit over to that guy, so I probably will reduce his attack. That cat is really, really funny. Thirteen attack. Go after this guy right here. Take him down to two attack. through that, but it wouldn't be enough to kill that dude. You can retreat and then give Luden a little bit more attention. I feel like it's smart to keep on wearing this guy down. These guys have a lot of damage they can do to Faust, so I'm gonna bring him over to call this guy's to catch this guy's attention. I don't care too much about him, so side and attack. Okay. Let's push this guy back. these guys. I can start doing that now, right? She got six. This guy's got ten, so he can kill you if you're not careful. some attention here. He's got some health left. Ouch. That was quite a bit of health, a damage to old Gris here. that transferred out over to the units around him, but I don't think it's going to. Let's go take care of this one. 
Nice, he's doing two inch damage to my friend. Griss right there. I could get in here and actually hurt these guys, but I can't, so I have to deal with something like this. Strip his armor. So you spread over to another guy. That's nice. He almost got him there. Six. I could taunt this guy. See if that works. Is it either that or strip him of a little bit of armor. So this guy's going to go next, which probably means that he's going to take out. Aw, our friend. No. Hakon's gonna go down in this fight, unfortunately. Hakon, you fool. That was perfect. He just did that perfectly to get that kill. We really need to push this dude back. Whoa, that was 8 damage. That was a lot. I don't know why I did that much. I probably should have saved him there instead of pushing. Ah. It's fine, don't worry about it. <laughs> he fell over. He got 11, which means I can just kill him right now with Ludin. Oh, Ludin. That was quite the fight, wasn't it? Take a moment to survey the battlefield. Yeah, we're retreating here. Pull back before they regroup. The dredge, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the same thing that you get. Whew. Get a little bit of renown right there. What's going on? I had one eye on the fight. Sorry, I'm just checking something really quickly. Next time I look down, the dredge are swarming in, into the courtyard. Yeah, that's, uh, that's how it is, isn't it? Can't tell how many more are waiting out there, but it's a lot. If we're going, if we're getting back across the bridge, it'll be a fight. Any options? Not really, unless you want to wade into that valley. We're going to have to leave the same way we came in. Hakon, I think you should take a look at this. Nearby, the man had been bundled and laid near a short wall, protected from the wind. I think this man is a mender. That raises more questions than it answers. What of it? The wave weaver, the spell weavers the, in Richhorn? Why? Maybe they knew something about what's happening. If he's going to tell us anything, we need to get it out of here alive. 
Maybe, uh, we need to rest, I think, a little bit. Half our guys just died. I agree, that's the side how we're going to defend this dump in case they attack again. Each day we wait here, the dredge are going to pile up. How will, how many will there be tomorrow? Double, what about the next day? Or, it's your call, hack on. We can't cut and run this one. There's one way out. If Vral fall, if anyone falls fighting here, they'll be left behind. I want to leave, but we just suffered a couple losses that are pretty bad. It, we should wait six days if we can. I don't think we're going to be able to, though. Luden wants to get out of town, I think. We'll rest just for like a day or two. Our dudes are too beat up to just run out of here right now. We'll set up watches, Moger. Who knows what the dredge will do in the meantime. I might try to starve us out or wear us down. I might try to hide their numbers. What do you want to do? Keep as many on watch as possible. Try to get a better count on the dredge. Focus on getting everybody ready, rested and ready. Try to get a better count on the dredge. I'll find some scouts. Moger says he heads off, gathers on tears. It might be a while before we hear anything, though. In the meantime, I'll make sure the others get rest. Oh, yeah, like my entire party has six days worth of injuries. I don't think I can afford to wait six days. I'd love to. Moger finds you with early, or finds you early with news uh, from the scouts that were sent out. The ones I put on the tower could only make out movements. Not much help there. Another group crawled into the mountainside and were able to get a better view. They think there might be about 300 of them watching us now, but they're. I'm screwing themselves in thicket, so it's hard to tell. What we do know is that there are that more are definitely showing up each day, just like we expected. We need to get out of here. So we waited two days. There's about 300 of them. People seem pretty rested. These two didn't need to go down at all in that last fight. It was a giant waste. Need to promote Luden, though. If we get out of here, it's going to be because Luden. Luden came in crucial in that last fight. Give him the ability to become more survivable in battle, I think. For that, I think I need to invest in linkage and, and willpower for him. Can we afford one more day? We're ready, what's our approach? Bait the dredge into attacking and wearing them down. Break them through the front line and don't stop. Use shield bangers forward and fight defensively. Go out, strike hard and drive them off. Send a division to draw their attention and a send a diversion to draw their attention and escape. I think. 
like a diversion might work. Break through the front lines and don't stop. I want to fight defensively, maybe. how that works. I hate to admit it, says Moger, but this might be the safest option. I just wouldn't expect to see them again. He gets a strange expression on his face. Uh, I'll lead. I can make sure you and the others escape. Find others, Moger, but not you. Consider other options. Uh, we're not sending Moger to die. We're gonna do this one. Send the shield bangers forward and fight defensively. We're doing this. Shield bangers and gather in f at the front of the group and push forward through bashing maces and exploding shrapnel. With few casualties, the caravan has crossed the land, crossed the land bridge. Now it's just. Uh, it just remains to fight your way out. As Moger predicted, they surround you from every direction. You start cracking heads as soon as possible as the shields give way to the crushing of enemies pushing past. Do we have to do a fight now? Is that... Is, that would seem reasonable. Yeah. I wish I waited another day. It would have been nice. this works out for us. I don't think we're going to win this fight. It's better than leaving Moger to die. Oh jeez, look how many big ones they have. We're not winning this. This is ridiculous. Already got reduced health on like half of my units. M more. More than half. Can I win this? Like, is that even possible? Ranger. And yes, I am bitter over that. Alright. I think this is the best I can do. Oh wait, Ludin, what are you doing? You're you're part of the team. I need you over here with the others. I think. some with this guy over here. He's got decent armor breaking, so I might just throw into the hem. I kick him off the side. These two engage this one. Oh, Sundering Impact, yeah, let's do that. Get out of 
face. That's a weird path, but okay. Wish he was ranged. It'd be pretty cool. gonna hurt or not thought that would do a little bit more damage you're sundering impact hey that that did a bit there did you kill one you killed one too he kicked the 14 back Start doing some damage to this guy. Not good. He's the battering ram one, so... Does good armor break. Whoa, look at that. That was crazy. Lots of armor break there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. If I can get more of that going, I will. Let's see if I can get this to go through the. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Look at that armor break, it just like went through all of them. I haven't seen that before in this game. Alright, so he's got 13, he's got 12. Both of them are threads. 12 goes before the 13. Well, that one's behind this. So he goes pretty late in the rotation after mogur has gone to go. So Mogur might be able to come down here. I ah, he won't be able to do much. And the rotation is this one. That's that one. That's this one. That one. I'm not sure if this one's showing up in the rotation yet, so I might want to go for that that guy right there.
kick him one over. That won't be enough. Let's kick him two over. Make him walk a bit. Leave him alone. Probably get Tempest on this guy and this guy. If I go for the right one, I won't hit my own unit. Going clockwise means I need to click on this one. We only want two enemies. We don't want to go to three enemies. Three enemies would be bad. So he's got eight attack. He's got seven. He's got ten. anybody nine I can really reduce this guy I could kill him Let's keep him in rotation, but reduced. Yeah, I thought that might be coming. That's not good for my buddy old pal down there. Now they're all spread out, this guy can actually get a hit on him. A 16 attack is not my favorite. So that guy is going soon. And that guy by this one and he does go kind of soon but I do get some other moves not really liking Luden's options
I think I have to. Oh nice, that did spread. I wasn't sure if it would. own allies armors instead of actually doing something useful perfect AI is taking mercy on me This guy right here has got 12 attack. That guy's got 9, that, that one's got 11. Let's look at who's attacking next. He'll go next. Probably break some armor on you. Same with this guy. He's pretty far down there on the rotation. Luden will get to go again before this guy goes. just not got a lot of moves, so I think I go in here and I uh, reduce his armor. So he, can, he can do 5 points of damage right there. That's, that's mm, not good. If I move here and kick him back, this guy might get an opportunity. He'll definitely get an opportunity. Die for the group here. But I don't know if the group can do this without you here just yet. his attack a tiny little bit if I can. And we're going to Tempest. Clockwise. Oh, he killed two guys there. I wasn't expecting that. He's got 10. He's got 8. It's not like trying to kill those little ones. Those little ones are making this a little bit easier. Eventually, though. Ooh. If I give him an uh, attack, I can move him down there. Start putting some hurt on this guy. I think it's best to reduce him or to kill him. to start taking these guys off the map, I think. There's too many of them.
Please don't kill him. Ooh. Now the question is, do I use two or just one willpower here? Gris will probably be able to come over and, and knock him around if I'm if I'm lucky, so I'm just gonna use one. Save up that willpower if I'm able to. I feel like he does more damage on his Tempest now than he used to. I don't know if I can take on another one. I kind of want to prioritize that thing if I can. Seven. So he goes next, followed by the big one. Just can you get there? you take out that one. So one wouldn't be enough to get him able to push that guy back, but one would be enough to get him in here to do a little bit of damage against that guy. Oh, you got three armor break. You gotta go for that. Especially since that goes over to the guy I need to kill here. Yes. There is the damage we are looking for. Wow. I really didn't think I'd be able to, to win this. quite kill him, but I can't push him back, so I will. Here goes my timer, so as soon as this battle's over, I think I'm gonna try and wrap this up. have enough for any more Tempest, or for using Tempest, which I have been enjoying. Ouch. That's a lot of armor damage he just did. Let me kill him. No! I don't think there's anything I can do to save him too. Which is pretty sad. Wait, Gris is gonna be able to get in there and attack as long as I don't kill this guy off. Can't get over there. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's 
So a six attack, two armor break. I was hoping that might somehow make its way to that guy, but I'm not exactly what I was sure what I was thinking because I don't know how that would happen. He has to go take care of that. I was worried he might go after him there. Kill him. We won! Oh wow. Okay. That's why you never give up, you never surrender. Take a little bit of armor off of that if he needs. Yeah, we'll give him one willpower to get into position. And to do some damage. And the victory! is a little bit injured our leader with the first wave of dredge out of the picture you stop and take stock of the bout that was the first wave your warriors are doing as well as you could have hoped fortunately there were enough of them to pull it off the dredge are furious but falling quickly you think you could safely outdistance them at this point yes let's do it leave no dredge alive Get out of here. We're way too weak. You take stock of the survivors. It hurts to think how many you lost to, to get this far with nothing but an unconscious mender to show for it. You hope it was worth it. Yes. Yeah, we're not going to keep fighting. For multiple reasons. I don't think I have the ability to win that fight. And I wanted to end this episode here. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to leave a like and to subscribe to the channel. And case you haven't already um and let's see i've also got links in the social uh, tour to my social media in the description below i'll see you around for the next one